Sir Tom Jones has questioned why Welsh rugby union bosses have banned choirs from singing his 1988 hit, Delilah. The award-winning track was first removed from the playlist of rugby choirs back in 2015. However, a full ban was implemented earlier this year. The exclusion means that the controversial song is now unable to be sung by choirs at Cardiff's Principality Stadium. Questioning the decision at his recent gig at Cardiff Castle, Sir Tom, 83, said, You can't stop us singing Delilah. Can you imagine? Who was the man who didn't want us to sing Delilah? Read more Kevin Costner's estranged wife holidays with family friend during divorce drama He stopped the choir from singing but he didn't stop the crowd from singing it. And we will keep singing it too, he added. Prior to 2015, the Welsh star's song was traditionally performed before matches at the Principality Stadium. However, in February, the rugby union decided to remove the song from its halftime entertainment and music playlist, due to its controversial subject matter. In a statement, they said, Delilah will not feature on the playlist for choirs for rugby internationals at Principality Stadium. The WRU removed the song from its halftime entertainment and music playlist during international matches in 2015. Guest choirs have also more recently been requested not to feature the song during their pre-match performances and throughout games. Don't miss! Tony Bennett's wives' message to fans after 96-year-old singer's death, photographs, Jeremy Clarkson issues explosive customer warning about his cider brand, insight, Stacey Solomon admits feeling mum guilt after not being around enough, video. Sir Tom's track was banned in February 2023 due to the subject matter of the song relating to domestic violence. The lyrics tell the story of a man who has caught his girlfriend cheating on him with another man. After confronting her, she feels no remorse and he decides to murder her with a knife and awaits his arrest. The WRU further stated, the WRU condemns domestic violence of any kind. We have previously sought advice from subject matter experts on the issue of censoring the song and we are respectfully aware that it is problematic and upsetting to some supporters because of its subject matter. Following Sir Tom's defiant stand at Cardiff Castle on Friday, fans have taken to social media to question why the song has been banned. One Twitter user said, absolutely ridiculous. Are we going to ban the most popular song of all time now, Bohemian Rhapsody, because of the mention of murder in the lyrics? A second wrote, totally agree, how daft is it to ban this famous and well-loved song? Another said, go for it rugby fans. Don't let the woke controllers block something that has done no harm since 1968. Despite the ban, the 83-year-old continues to play the track live.